Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be doing my highlight and contour routine. I did my highlight and contour routine. I have my eye makeup on and my um, eyebrows. I need to do an eyebrow tutorial, but, but a barber shaved my eyebrows and now it takes me forever to do my eyebrows. Like this one always higher. So it takes me a minute to do my eyebrows. My eyebrow grows back in place, I guess. I'll do an eyebrow tutorial. But until then, yeah. So if you want to see how I get this done, just keep on watching. So I use my face with my, I think the brand name is Simple. This, I think this is too much. You don't need more than this, but I think this is a bit too much but um I have oily skin but even if you have oily skin you have the moisture it's, your skin will produce more oil so basically the moisturizer helps you to what's that word I'm looking for how do you do what sometimes my mind goes blank and I can't remember the things I'm supposed to say so that's why talk truths are kind of hard for me Cause sometimes my head just it just it just go yeah even though if, if, if you have oily skin you should still moisturize basically that's basically what I'm saying I like to rub it in until it can't feel it doesn't feel sticky then when I finish I like push it in my skin I mostly get um, oily um, my t-zone t-zone is right here in the middle of her head yeah, I must get oily there now I am done moisturizing I'm going to prime with I'm going to choose two primers I'm going to use my Rimmel Stay Matte Primer and my professional from the bomb my pores are huge so I really like this primer I'm going to put it I'm going to put the, the professional in my t-zone where I have pores mostly use my remote primer to put on the rest of my face why did I put it on my chin Now that my face is all prepped and primed, I'm going to use my foundation. I'm going to apply my foundation. I'm going to use my Revlon Color Stay foundation in caramel or the number 400. And I'm going to apply that with my BH Cosmetics foundation brush. It's time to apply my concealer. I'm going to use my Elegir Pro Concealer in Fawn to highlight. You can either go in with a beauty sponge. Mine is very dirty. Beauty sponge. You can either go in with a beauty sponge 
on a brush like this. I'll be using this brush. I'll be using this brush because I don't know. Recently, um, I keep going for it, and I normally spray it with my Mac Fix Plus and just blend. I don't really cream contour but for the purpose of this video I'm going to so I'm going to take my black opal true color foundation stick in hazelnut so um beige cosmetics brush I use it for foundation sometimes but a stippling brush I think but it's not as it's kind of soft over with my same foundation brush I'm just blending blending it together just blending them now I'm going to take and I'm going to bake with my um face by Shana loose bamboo powder in butternut is it butternut butternut squash I think butternut is a smidge, a smidge darker than um bamboo. I'm gonna have to put a little. I'm gonna have to put a little bit of bamboo on. You know, even though. I don't really cream contour my um, nose I don't think I need to now I'm going in with my covergirl ebony bronzer contour to set my contour a blending brush to contour my nose I always use my fingers. Just a thing I do. I always do that. I don't know why. Using my face powder, this is Milani Minerals Compact Powder in deep. And this big BH Cosmetics brush to dust away, to set everything. Dust away and set. I'm going to set my face with the MAC Fix Plus to get rid of that powdery ness. Like just drench, drench your body in it. Just drench your body. I'm going to use my Carly Bible palette and use. D 
these two right here at the bottom I'm going to take that even further with my Wild and Radiant palette and just put in everything. Come extra. This, this one to put on my cupid and my nose. I don't mean to um give you a middle finger or anything I just, I just use this finger to highlight my nose I'm sorry then I'm going to drench again so guys that's it I added eyeliner mascara and I added um on my lips I have on what is this again tool from Colourpop and uh, yeah that's it for this video guys hope you like my highlight and contour routine I mean I hope it helped you in some sort of way if you didn't know how to highlight or contour but this is the way this is the way I do my highlight and contour everybody does it differently but yeah I'm just showing my showing you my version I don't always um, cream contour I normally just use my powder and uh, yeah I don't always bake either because since recently because I've been doing um, so much videos the 12 days of Christmas and all I've been doing like two videos um, I've been filming twice a day so that's why under my eyes are kind of dry so I don't really bake as I don't really bake as much but I'm using this um, Icelandic Icelandic relief eye cream um, I got in my um, boxy November boxy charm. It's kind of dirty. Hold on. It's 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 from the brand Skin, and it's their Icelandic relief eye cream. Look like this. I use this under under my eyes probably twice a week. Hopefully it can um, revive that. Hopefully it can help under my eyes to not be so dry. And on my eyes, I use this Studio Makeup On The Go Eyeshadow Palette. It looks like this. I got this in my... I got this also in my November Boxy Charm. So, yeah. Um, that's it for this video. Let me know if you like me in curly hair. Like... Let Aniga know if you like me in curly hair because I dig it. I dig it. Like, dog. Like, bra. You see this glow here? You see, you see it? Like, you see this? You see where I go on? Like, just take a moment for the glow. One moment. It, it is, it, it. You understand? You understand? Like, one minute for the glow. All right. Anyways, let me know if you like being curly hair. <laughs> I'll put in the description box below on the lengths of my hair and where did I get them and who did it. Same person, by the way, it's the same person I got it from and did my hair. As always, one person let do my hair if I don't do it myself. Yeah, I'll show you the kind of hair. All those hair details will be in the description box. I'm more of a straight or body wave type of girl or catch up my hair in one you know so this is my first 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 girl here anyways so let me know what you think down below girl. also comment down below on which other looks you'd like to see me do also let me know on let me know which look was your favorite look from my 12 days of Christmas yeah let me know which one and yeah that's it for this tutorial guys don't forget to like comment share subscribe all the nice is there and i'll see you in my next video